welcome to another 3d intro video tutorial so in this video i'm going to show you how to make this type of 3d intro video in adobe after effects so you can see that i have already created this animation and now i'm going to show you how i create this to make this i'm going to create a new composition and rename it for 3d intro and i'm going to use 25 duration and 1920 pixel by 1080 then hit ok now let's create a new solid and i'm going to rename it to logo mask then hit ok i'm going to use this logo i download it from free pick so select this logo and go to edit then copy now back to after effects select this and press ctrl b or go to edit and paste it here so this is our logo mask now turn off this now right click on our mouse go to new create another new solid rename it e3d for 11 3d then hit ok now go to effect and control right click on your mouse go to video copilot and select element from here go to customize layer then custom text and mask and from path 1 select logo mask now close it go to scene setup click on it so it will open our element 3d interface now just click on extrude so this is our logo select this extrusion model then go to tessellation and from here select path resolution to extreme now select this click here and change bevel copy to 2 now for the bevel copy one change its size to 1.5 and bevel copy two change its size to one now click here and turn off the grid now go to presets and go to pro shaders and then select metal and from here select the gold and apply it to this bevel two sorry apply to bevel one and then back to procedure two go to metal and apply this to here now zoom it select this go to bevel curves and change bevel depth to or maybe 2.5 select this and change it to 1.3 let's cut now go to create and create a plane and go to plane size change it to 50 also make it to 50 as well now click here and rotate it like this click here and let's drag it to something like this point now select this also apply this material to here and click here and then go to uv mapping and change this to 10 now select this plane model right click go to reflection mode and change it to mirror surface and select this right click change reflection mode to spherical and from here change its color to something like stylize now our 3d logo is ok from here just click on ok right click on your mouse go to new create a new camera hit ok now you can select this element 3d then click on scene setup select this plane model and select this then go to advance and change force of city to something like 30 now hit ok now select the camera now just follow my steps
select this go to render setting go to mb inoculation and from here enable this and change this intensity to 10 and change radius to 15 or maybe 5 now go to lighting and from here change it to stylus as well now right click on your mouse go to new create a new light change it to parallel light then hit ok let's adjust the lighting from here click here and then go to light option then change intensity to 80 now select the camera let's zoom the logo from here move it to something like this select the camera press p and shift a now create a keyframe to here then go to around 5 second then drag this to something like this and move this to this point now select this camera press ctrl shift d now close it and select this camera to press u and delete all of these keyframes now again select this move tool drag this to something like this point also make it like this create a keyframe here now go to around 10 second and make it something like this and let's zoom it little bit move it to this point now again select camera 2 press ctrl shift d to duplicate it here close this press u then delete all of them now go to around 15 second let's zoom out now now bring this logo to center something like this now create a keyframes here back this frame make this something like this and then click here and go to 15 second again create a keyframe to the orientation back to here and let's rotate it something like this 75 now select this go to layer create a new adjustment layer rename it to carbs now go to effect and presets and search for carbs select red make it something like this ok now create another adjustment layer and rename it to locks now again go to effect and presets and search for locks apply it click to edit and select spot focus from here let's make it something like this hit ok and change straight to 20% or maybe 30 now go to project i have this flare download link in video description you can download it and let's drag this to the timeline and change its mode to screen and press t to open opacity make it 50. now let's create another new solid rename it black select this ellipse tool 
draw a ellipse like this click here and double click bring it to make it something like this and click on this mask one change feather to very high and change it to subtract now select this press t and change this opacity to 30 or maybe 25 okay our animation is ready so now let's see the preview So this is the video, hope you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed then make sure to like this video and subscribe my channel and don't forget to turn on the notification. So thank you so much for watching, I will be back with new tutorials soon, till then take care.